A campaign is set to kick off at Cabrillo High School in Lompoc. It's similar to the renovation of Houck Stadium at Lompoc High about three years ago. And News Channel 12's Dave Alley reports. A dream decades in the making to modernize and renovate the athletic stadium here at Cabrillo High School is gaining momentum and is at long last moving closer to becoming reality. Cabrillo's upper sports field sits empty and unused. There's holes everywhere and can't really do anything on here. It's um, yeah, it's a safety hazard. Poor conditions with the grass and track surfaces have long rendered the stadium off limits for games and practices. We practice in the staff parking lot and practice starts 20 minutes after the last bell rings. So we have to wait for all the cars to leave. Without a stadium of their own, students feel it leaves them disadvantaged. We're out here playing on a field that doesn't even have the 50 yard line. Doesn't even have, um, you know, it doesn't have any markings. It's hard to play at a field where you don't know where you're at. And I think it's time for some change. And changes are on the way. A grassroots committee has formed to help spearhead a renovation project. It's going to be uh, the synthetic turf athletic field as well as a seven lane uh, synthetic all weather track. To pay for it will be a collaboration between the community and Lompoc Unified School District. We anticipate that the total project will be somewhere around 2.4 to 2.6 million and the district has committed a million of that. This has been a long time coming and we're very excited about uh, achieving that equitable experience for the students here at Cabrillo. This project will not include the installation of lighting, bleachers, snack bar or other amenities. The plan is to potentially add those features at some point in the future. This is probably a three phase project. The second phase is probably going to be some bleacher and seating arrangements and then down the road a uh, third phase it would be an opportunity to put lights up and have as they say Friday night lights. Which will put Cabrillo finally on a level playing field with the competition. I think it mean the world to this school. The school really deserves it. I mean, it'd be just so much better, so much easier. I think that getting the field will help the school be the best it can, not just with band, but with everything. The hope is fundraising efforts will be completed sometime this year, so construction on the project could finish next year, coinciding with the 60th anniversary of Cabrillo High School. In Vandenberg Village, I'm News Channel reporter Dave Alley.